Hey guys, it's Senator Barry Griffin on Born and Bred Bahamian with Fincastle Media Group at the Driftwood Studios. One, two, three. Eyes up. Born and bred Bahamian. Born and bred. These Bahamian colors, they rushing through my veins. Born and bred Bahamian. Born and bred. I can show you how I born and bred. <laughs> Hello, hello, hello everybody. I'm Bodine Victoria, your resident Bahama Mama, and you are watching Born and Bred Bahamian shot right here at Driftwood Studios and a production of the Fincastle Media Group. Today, I'm gonna be on my very best behavior because I was told to behave and we also have Senator Barry Griffin in studio with me today. Hello, thank you for having me. Hi, Senator. Now, y'all like, you don't have to behave, but be nice. <laughs> <laughs> I'm always nice. Okay, okay. Okay, I have a little bit of broad up seat. Okay. What do you think a person who is on a roundabout should do when they are met with somebody that does not know how to use a roundabout? Drive them off the road. <laughs> no, I'm joking. <laughs> um, Just... But I think most Bahamians don't know how to use the roundabout, and that is a pet peeve of mine. Mm -hmm. So what should you do? Blow them out the way. No out just the way. blow them out the way. Blow them out the way. Yeah, just, yeah. that's it. Yeah. Do you turn on your turning signal? Because I think you're old enough for this. Do you turn on your turning signal when you are on the roundabout? I don't. You shouldn't have to turn on your turning signal when you're on the roundabout. What do you mean? Like if you're coming off of the uh -huh. roundabout, if you are in the right lane, you don't need to turn on your turning signal. No. But hold on, the right lane as in the right lane? No, I lane, mean the correct one you the... should be in. <laughs> yes, if you, okay, so. So am I driving the roundabout wrong all this time? Somebody driving it wrong, but I don't think it's me. I ain't saying it's you, but I don't think it's but me. But it's not you, okay, <laughs> okay. Right, now we had, we had a heathen here who said that mayonnaise <clears throat> goes in Kong salad. What say you? I've never had it. So I don't want to say no, but for <laughs> now, is not for me. Nah. Um, yeah, they say they do that in Abaco and Grand Bahama. Grand Bahama. Specifically yeah. sweet and ski in Ethan, apparently. Yeah, I don't know if I could do that. I don't know. I don't know. These good people, we know. Yeah. Like, I don't, sorry, y'all Ethans. Yeah. <laughs> it, it can happen. Blasphemous, right? Yes, yeah. highly blasphemous. Yeah. Jesus is not pleased. Yeah. If we... <laughs> if you had one Bahamian childhood memory that you want to share with the people, what would it be? Crabbing in Andrus. You could crab? A little bit. Okay. So Explain my family, it. my family's from Andrus, the dad side of my family. So as a kid, I would go to Andrus every summer. Mm -hmm. And I remember the first summer I went there and learned how to crab. So we took the truck out late at night, just your little flashlight, and I got bit by crab like more than I could say. But it was fun and I learned <laughs> how to do it. And by the end of the night, I was picking up crab and throwing them in the bag. So I, I still can't pick up a live crab. Yeah. I am not See, I'm not afraid it. of it anymore. You know, after you got bitten ten times, you know, you just you just roll with it. So I'm still at the point where my mommy have to put, pick the crab for me. Mm -hmm. You mean like take the bite yep. off? She, she, yeah, she sure better. Yeah. And then I will clean it and I will cook it. And I still cry when you have to open them. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Do you cook crabs? I don't really know how to cook. You don't? I like to eat, but <laughs> I don't really know how to cook. Who? Who you grow up with? Like, <laughs> mean, I, like... I, I, like <laughs> They never taught me how to cook, and I tell my dad that all the time. He taught my little sister, didn't, didn't, didn't teach me. Oh, y'all, yeah. he needs somebody to teach him how to cook. Yeah. So, so you eat out. Eat out, yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. And then I mean, I cook the basics, but when you're talking about like a big Bahamian meal, uh -huh. like no. I'll What's be the lost. basics? I could do rice. I could do like chicken. I could, you know, I could season chicken. I could bake things. Okay. I could do a basic rice, you know, that mm -hmm. kind of thing. Big question of the day because okay. somebody got it wrong already. How do you season your chicken? Well, first of all, you gotta clean the chicken. Right. I think that's big. Uh -huh. And then you uh, clean it with, with lime. Mm -hmm. And then you season it with, you know, whatever you want lime. What, what do you mean, what do I do? Yeah, the lime, traditional. Uh -huh. um, black pepper, salt. And then, depending on what you want, you know, season all or whatever else. How do you season it? We don't use season oil on our chicken. I'm, you know what I'm saying? It depends on it depends on what you want. But for me, I like traditional black pepper salt. But then you want a little different Bird flavor. pepper, like goat pepper. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like goat pepper and salt on I the like chicken. Spicy, I like spicy food, so uh -huh. goat pepper, bird pepper, uh -huh. definitely, okay. yes. yes. I was concerned just yes. now. <laughs> no, definitely. The pearls were about to be clutched. No, definitely, <laughs> yes. Has anybody treated you like a conch? 
I don't think so. No. No. You don't get them that chance. No. Okay. No. no. You're smarter than the owl. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Carry on. Last question. If you were to go to any island in the Bahamas and do mm -hmm. one thing that you could do just about all day, what would mm -hmm. it be? Where would it be and what would it be? I think Exuma is one of the most beautiful islands. I've never been swimming with the pigs. Mm -hmm. That is on my to-do list. Okay. Swimming with the pigs. Yeah. When we get off camera, I can tell you a secret about swimming with the pigs, okay? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> but y'all, this has been Born and Bred with Senator Barry Griffin. It's been my pleasure having you. And I gotta tell him the jokes off camera. The real jokes. The other jokes. Because the cameraman tell me I had to behave today, so I, you, you got saved. Okay, you good, got saved. good, good. Okay, we can be back.